I like that's a joke. I thought Clouds was cool. Someone said, do I see the growth? I, I didn't get to read your whole thing in my voice or my rapping or something. Uh, yeah, I cringe at so much of my old stuff. Um, but that's just part of being an artist and being a creative. I feel like you get to witness. It sucks that it's out there. But you, you get to... I listen to back... Me and Tommy were listening back to um, old stuff the other day. And we both were like... Because we've been working together now for like seven years or more. I don't even know. And you listen back to the stuff that you've done. And it's like terrible. I think my writing's terrible. Things I'm doing with my voice. Things I'm saying. Um, but, you know, that's just part of growing as an artist. I would encourage anyone who... I mean, I sucked so bad when I started making music. So if you want to make music or do something, you you might suck in the beginning, but I don't know. You might as well just try. Yeah, someone just posted a lyric from intro. I love intro, but that's a perfect example of like the beginning. Someone said, any more music videos coming from the mixtape? Um, it's possible. I'm trying to work on a full-length record. Um, obviously, this one just came out, but... Sorry, I'm just trying to read these. You prefer slower song or faster pace? Um, it depends what mood that I'm in. I like making music that's like moving, but I guess you know you can have that from a fast paced song. I love the trust song um, on the record. I like the chorus. I just like how the whole thing feels. Um, but then I like Prideful a lot. Prideful music like that, I'll listen to a lot of stuff like that when I'm driving down the road. Someone said Layers was crazy. Yeah, I love that one too. I rewrote the beginning of that song like 10 times. I just did not know how I wanted it to go. That just happens to me. Sometimes I'll write something and then rewrite it like 10 times. Drifting, what was the process like? Um, at some point, I think drifting was going to be on the next project, which I'm glad it wasn't because I don't think I would have wanted it on there. Sometimes I'll start making songs right after, like right after the search happened. I'll start getting in the studio making stuff, and then I hear it later, and I'm like, oh, man, it feels dated. Um, and that could have ended up being one of those songs, I don't know, but Drifting was really left field for me in the beginning, like the, you guys obviously never heard the beat, it was very similar to what it was, but it didn't, that, that humming sample on the top of it is me, um, and I added that later, and it completely changed the feel of the song in a way that I loved it, so, um, but the process of that song was like me and a lot of times I can make music that sounds a lot different than what I normally do. It's just whenever I try doing it, a lot of times I I don't like it or I feel like it sucks in some way. Um, me and Tommy laugh about that in the studio all the time um, because it's not that I can make a whole record that sounds like nothing I've ever done before, but sometimes I hear it and I feel like it sounds like everything else or whatever and I always end up steering us in a different direction but yeah drifting was that was a cool one to make uh originally it didn't even have the big rap verse at the end it just had a piano outro and then uh, I every time I heard the song I was like man I feel like it needs to end differently or something needs to happen and then we ended up 
adding all that at the end. 